Hey guys, Preston here, and we're continuing our story of Preston Champ so far. Last episode, we did get a call up to the major leagues. San Diego Padres put us on the 40 man roster, and now we're going to be going through the next couple of games. As you can see, doing pretty good. We're banging above 300 right now. I'm going to be playing a series against the Atlanta Braves, who aren't really doing too good at all. We are 52 and 49, they're 50 and 52, so maybe they had a little bit of injuries or something because their record doesn't really reflect how good of a team they are. So if we are banging 333 on the year, no home runs, no RBIs. And then we go to the top of the second, run around second base, two outs, full count, two champs, and he's got to rip that pitch into deep center field. And it looks like the center field is going to go off the wall and not make the catch. Champs, he's going to round second, he's going to go to third to throw, will not just be cut off to the, to the cutoff man. And Champs works in nice, I think triple maybe, or maybe double, however they score that. And just like that, Champs is getting off to a very nice start. And now we're going to be on base right now, on third base, two outs, one, two, count. And it's going to be a swing and a miss, I think that's the pitcher, or maybe the, I think catcher, maybe actually, it was struck out. Now we're going to the bottom of the second inning, on count, and it's going to be a little dribbler, two champs who make the easy throw over the first base, and that will be in time. Not really, not too many throwing errors you really see from Preston Champs. We're on first and second now, two outs, no count, two champs, and the pitch. Champs is going to rip that pitch into deep left center field, and that one is going to just barely, not just, just almost, almost actually just got over the the wall. Champs is going to try stretching a double into a triple. He's unsuccessful, just barely got it thrown out. But he does get a couple of RBIs, I think one RBI or two. And now we're two for three on the day. Bases loaded, one out, one out count, two champs. Let's see if you can do something right here. Put the San Diego Padres up by a lot right here. And that's gonna be a little drill, but it's gonna get through the hole into right field for a nice base hit. One run will score, and Padres are up four to one. Champs having a pretty good day batting wise. He's now I think three for four or four for four or something like that. Now bases loaded, one out, two on count to the better and he's gonna hit that pitch into between first and se first baseman and second baseman moves the runners each up by a base and Padres take a 5-1 lead now base is loaded still two outs 2-0 -oh count to the better and the pitcher is gonna pitch that's gonna be a semi -de deep fall into right field foul territory and the right fielder make the play uh, we are 3-for-3 three, th three three in the day so far triple a double and a single we have a chance of getting the second way at top of the eighth inning Home run shy of the cycle, and it's going to be hit off the pitcher. And it's going to be an easy play for Chris Johnson to make the play with the first base. And the, and the champs is going to be an unsuccessful game with a triple right there. Now, Bob and Ethan, and we're on first base. One will count one out. It's going to be a little hit. Two champs going to flip on the second on the first, and it'll be a 4 6 3 double play. That's going to be end of that game. Did pretty good. Three for four with a double, a triple, and a single three ribbies. And the manager's looking pretty. The manager's gonna give a nice talk to uh, champs. Here we are, three for four in the day. Well, just one a home run shy of the cycle. That would have been nice because we are still pretty early in our, career, in our career so far. Now we go into the next game against the uh, Braves, and it's gonna be a pinch hit opportunity. We're banging over four, 400 now. That one, that past game we just had, that, those are first three RBIs we've ever gotten in our career so far. So not a lot of playing time, be, a lot. It's been uh, not really. Champs isn't really given too many opportunities really, and it's going to be a fielder's choice, and Champs is going to beat out. So the runner on second base is going to be, it's going to get out, but Champs beats out the throw. Now the top of the six still, and Champs is off to second base. The throw will just barely be in time, just a tiny bit. Champs is an 85 speed, so he's only get thrown off too often. Here we're batting eighth in the line, bottom of the second inning, two two count to the better. We're already down two nothing. That's not good at all. And uh, it's gonna be, and the pitch is gonna be hit. It's gonna be easy play for Champs right there. Uh, feeling feeling opportunities aren't really that exciting anymore in this in this thing. Uh, the major leagues, it's pretty much just singles or hits. It's not really the most complex position to play second base for this MLB fourteen this show. And here, look at this, it's gonna be easy play over. Just flip over the second base on the first, and that will not be in time. I think our run score is actually maybe I don't know, something like that. We have to make a third error. We're over one today, three seventy five batting average, no home runs, three ribbies, and let's see if we can raise that batting average even more. O2 count, one out, two champs. And it's gonna be champs is gonna be jammed in right there. Chris Johnson is gonna make the make the fly out catch. 
and Champs now for two. Top of the eighth inning, 0 1 count. And the pitcher is going to pitch it right down the middle. And Champs, he's going to hit it to the shortstop. Injured and Simmons. Simmons is going to make the nice play, but first baseman can't hold on to the ball. And I think they, I think they give it an error, maybe, probably. Now Champs is out for second base. Let's see if he can get that time. He will. And now we go into the next next pitch. It's going to be hit past the pitcher. Second baseman is going to make a, a barehanded play, and he will just barely get the out. That's pretty much it for the day. We, they do count that as a hit, though. So we were 1 for 3 on the day. We lower our batting average just a tiny bit. And let's see what Champs, Champs can do in his second or third game. Uh, it's going to be the, the series finale against the Braves. Top of the second inning now. We're up one nothing, Two outs. And Champs is going to hit that pitch. Tickers Johnson makes the easy play over the first base. And he's struggling a bit right now. Champs had a hot, hot start. But he seems to not really be hitting the ball as well as he used to. And that pitch he's going to. And Champs is going to pull that pitch right there. And it's going to be an easy out in to the shortstop. So, a little bit of struggling right here. Nothing really going on too much. T top of the seventh thing now. Uh, Padres are going to be up 3 1. 2 1 count. A little dribbler to the pitcher. Who's going to make the easy throw over the first base. And Champs has yet to get a hit in this game. Just struggling. Wait, just struggling a lot. Here we have maybe you can get a chance right here. We're over 3 in the day. Just to cut all, all of our ground outs. And just not really good hits at all. We're up 4 1. Top of the ninth inning. 1 2 count. And Champs is going to hit that pitch to the shortstop again. Simmons makes the easy play, and that'll be in time. Nothing going on much for Champs in this last in the series finale game for the Bra for the, against the Braves. But we are going to have one last opportunity to do something. I mean, Bob Matt didn't one on count. And the pitch that's going to be hit to Champs' easy routine play, and that'll do it for the game. Champs not really doing too much at all, but oh, series overall, he did very good. We went 0 for 4. You don't want to do that, basically. So, that's pretty much guys to me. So, my last person, I'll see you guys later tomorrow. Maybe we'll see some Kansas Royals action. Maybe some New York Yankees franchise. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know what I have in store for you guys. So, I'll see you guys later. So, see ya.